It is game three on deck here tonight for this playoff series. Huge game for both teams. Let's drop the puck. And we are about set to drop the puck tonight. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building, and we are underway. And now it's grabbed by Fox. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Fox got it in the corner. Quick pass to Constantini. Slides it back to the blue line. Takes a shot. Off the club and makes the save. Poked away in the offensive end. Here's a shot. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. Well, the official is right there to make the tripping call, and it's a pretty easy one as the stick gets caught up in his opponent's face. Our first look tonight at their power play unit. First power play opportunity of the game, and to set the tempo, the trend on the specialty team unit. Here's a shot. Great chance, and an even better save. momentum. Kansas City's penalty killers get a hold of it. What a steal in his own end. And manages to clear the zone. Let's see what the officials are calling. Well, the official is right there to make the call, and no question about it, it's tripping. Anytime you take someone's feet out from under them, you're going to head to the box for two. Tulsa salivating with a five-on-three power play. Five-on-three, so much ice available, you can't overthink it, but you have to have the ability to move the puck. Know which side you want to be on, onside, offside for the one-timer, but you have to make the drive to the net. Chance to reset here on the draw on this man advantage. Off the draw, nice job locking up his opponent. And the puck clears the zone. Hayhurst's going to join the penalty kill here as they remain shorthanded. They go on the attack through center. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Cullis. Puck clear from the defensive end. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Tulsa's got it along the wall. Big time saving goal as he gets over with the stick. The Mavericks get a hold of the puck along the boards. Skips out of the battle along the boards, and here we go. The Oilers are across the line and into the offensive end. Shot! What a block of stop at point blank range by Morris! That's a great save, but the goaltender had to get out to the top of his crease, take away all the ice, and make himself as big as possible. And he takes the dish. He gets a piece of that one. Still lots of time left here in this frame. The game is still scoreless. Kansas City's going to start with the puck inside the offensive zone. The Oilers look to start the transition game. Gaining momentum along the wing. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. The Mavericks will play it in their own end. Pokes the puck away. Tulsa's looking to break out of their own end. And that pass is redirected. Battling for it along the boards. Kansas City's got a hold of it along the wall. netbar has got it along the wing. Here's a short pass to Hayhurst. Blocked in traffic. McKee's got the puck in his own zone. And some good footwork to kick it away. Barron's got the puck. Kansas City's got control of it now from their own end. Gains the zone on the left wing. Puck picked up by Coulson. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Oh, he misses that one. The momentum is everything in the game of hockey, James. Get on the board first. Nonetheless, you have to get it on net. 
Matsushima's got it against the boards. Puts it on net. Line. Sometimes players get into those scoring areas. Scores! And with that, I believe that's his first career playoff goal. Well, it is, James, and it's going to feel pretty good because there's a lot of question marks around players who can't get it done in the playoffs, and he finds the back of the net. That's going to give him a big confidence boost to send him through the next game. That's what you call having a knack for the net, James. When you get in tight and you're sniffing around, you better get that puck off quickly because you know there's defenders all in around you that are going to come and close. Tulsa's done a nice job staying with their game, and it finally pays off your Cheryl with a goal. Yeah, when you trust the process and you stay to task, this is exactly what happens. You have good habits, you find a way to get it done, and you execute. Now you got to build on it. you got to find a way to get another one and continue on with consistency. The is taken along the wall. Takes the feed. Johnson for the puck and is knocked away. And the puck leaves the offensive end. They'll be forced to do it over from center. Costantini's got it in the defensive end. Takes the feed. Shot. That's blocked. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Past the halfway mark of this period, Tulsa's ahead, 1-0. Kansas City's got a hold of the puck. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Solid check to slow him down. Quick feed to Fox. Cod stick handling in his own zone. The Oilers looking against the half wall. Can't complete the pass as it goes off a stick. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. Montreal's got it in the offensive zone. Kansas City's gained possession along the boards. With some open space at center. Moves it to the middle. Now he comes up with a stop. Puck grab by Boudreaux. Into the offensive end right up the middle. To point blank. From point blank range. Love the way the goaltender gets tight to the shooter here. The puck's in the low slot. You want to take away time, you want to take space. Goaltender does it, makes the save. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Just here in the late stages of this frame, we've got a one nothing hockey game thus far. Kansas City's got the win off that draw. passing is what leads to this one-timer opportunity and it wasn't just an opportunity James it was a direct finish as he just slaps it and hammers it home teams are lined up and we are ready to take this draw and they grab possession of the puck after that center ice face off from the left side into the middle of the neutral zone the Mavericks gain possession. Kansas City's got it in their own zone. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Lodge has got it along the boards. From the right side and up the middle. Rocked him in the open ice. Shot, big stop, just as time expires in the period. There's the buzzer, 20 minutes in the books, second period just around the corner. Opening face off here in this second period is about set to go. You can tell we're in for a good one because almost every fan is in their seats here as we are still tied with the second getting underway. Well, Cheryl, how do you sum this one up for the first 20 minutes? Morris is in fine form tonight at the top of the screen, not sitting back in his net, finding ways to trap pucks, read plays, 
and the only reason his team is tied. Lots of time left in this period. It's all tied up. Fox won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. Takes the feed, moving in. Moves it to Cobb. Right in front of the official's eyes, and the hand is in the air. Natural tendency for players is to reach when they've lost position on their opponent. When you reach, often you take out the feet of your opponent. This is an easy tripping call. Tulsa's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. When the power play is struggling, you've got to get pucks to the net. And you have that to have net front presence. Take away the tender's eyes. You know they work on it from a young age. Puck tracking skills, anticipation. Don't let the tender see the puck. And they manage to clear it. Takes it from the right side. Moves it quickly over to Kukovic. Gets a piece of it with the glove. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. Anytime you lose position on your opponent, this can happen. He gets the sticks out from the feet of his opponent, and guess what? He gets the tripping ball. He went this with a five on three, and they've got loads of time to work with here. With all this time on the five on three, yes, you can be more patient, but you don't want to get loads of sleep on the outside. You have to move the coverage a little bit outside of the middle of the ice to be able to open up those lanes and execute. Fox ready for the draw as we get set to resume this power play. Hayhurst won a big draw on their own end. And they move the puck out of harm's way. The Oilers take it along the wall. Takes the pass from the left wing. Oh, a clutch save! Koski's back out onto the ice, and they will continue to play shorthanded here. This penalty kill will continue. Fox won the face off, and now let's see what they can do. Oh, he gets a piece of the puck to the back of there. And the puck clears the zone. They'll be forced to leave as well. Quick pass to Fox. Great defensive effort with the stick. And as both teams are now back in even strength, the power play goes over on the opportunity. I really like what this PK unit has done. And James, in my experience, I know what it's like to be out there in a tie game. You want to execute your role to the best of your ability. You know what it's like to go down by one, and it's really deflating when it happens on a PK. So finding how to do it, getting it done, just did it. Gains the zone along the right wall. Hands in front, and he denies that great opportunity there. Slick feed. And that tears off a body in traffic. And it banks off a stick in traffic. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Here's a short pass to Carr. Quick shot! Great glove save by Morris! A timely save is everything to your team, and this goaltender, he bails his team out. More than half the period left to play. We are all tied up in this one. Off the draw, they take possession. And now he moves it quickly to Koski. Can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Tulsa's got possession here in their own end. The Oilers have it now. Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. Handles the puck. Quick shot. Stops him cold. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off.
Lodges won the draw and they're on the attack. With authority. the draw here in the defensive zone. The Mavericks gain control of the puck. And it's kicked away. Nafbar is moving the puck through his own zone. The Oilers possession here in the open ice. Tulsa's got possession of the puck. Ferenc taking it from his own end. Takes the feed. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. To the front. The Mavericks get a hold of the puck in their own end. Kansas City's crossed the line and on the attack. Here's a chance! And that's off the club and will play on! Penalty coming up here. You can almost hear the size on the bench as that third penalty within the frame has been called here. James, a tough position as they can't get any rhythm going on their bench. Team's opportunity for both sides as the man advantage unit is back to work again. Well, they haven't scored on the power play yet, and it is a tough thing to do, and this is an earned opportunity. They practice, they know what they're doing, it'll come. Battle along the wall. Can't get a hold of that pass. The Oilers have it now. Slides the puck across to Cod. On the attack along the boards. Puck scooped up by Cod. Keeps possession on the play. They clear the zone. Taken by Cotton. Quick feed to Jones. Back to the blue line. Grabs it with the glove. The Mavericks are back to even strength here. And even when you're on a power play, you have more time and space, but you have to have urgency, and there is none on that PP sequence. This group has to figure out a way to generate. Tulsa's got the puck inside the defensive zone. They've got the defense outnumbered. Oh, what a save in front! What a fantastic save from a high danger scoring area, James. And I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Kelvis has it in the defensive end. Moves it to Putria. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Long pass across the ice. Tulsa's got it in their own zone. Slides it over to Farron. Kansas City's got possession here in the neutral zone. And he slides it quickly to Duquette. Tulsa's got the puck. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Passes on over to Farron. Slides it across to Poulsen. Kansas City's got it from behind the net. Curry's lugging the puck. The Mavericks gain the zone. Barron's got the puck now at his own end. Moves it quickly over to Butcher. Dumps it in. Kansas City's got the puck along the boards. Right up the gut into the offensive end. Kansas City's playing it from the side. And a strong effort on that play. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right side. Beautiful read in the defensive end by McLaughlin. A skilled use of the stick to put the puck away. And that's turned aside. You have to be quick in your crease if you want to be able to deny low zone shots. He does that perfectly as he's tight to the shooter right there. of this period, we got a tie game. And they win the draw on their own end. Slides the puck over. Fires it on net. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. We'll get a face off after the puck stays covered up. And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. And they take possession off the draw here in their own end. And there's 
the buzzer, bringing the second period to an end. You don't want to go home yet, do you? Third period action. Um, Just moments away from the start of the third period. This one's still deadlocked as we are now underway here in the third. That sails over the net. That knocks it off the puck. Fires it. And that's blocked in traffic. A chance in front. Denies him in close. He does a great job of having sound positional play based on where the puck is on that low inner spot. And he makes himself big, takes away the holes, and makes the save. And that's some great pressure in the offensive end by Fuck. And he takes the feed. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Quick pass to Koski. From in close. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. Right through center and into the offensive zone. Solid hit on the play and that knocks the puck off his stick. Nafbar's crossed the line and is on the attack now. Broken up by Constantini. Slides it over with pace to Putria. Gaining momentum along the boards. Here we go, pucks in deep. Tulsa's got a hold of the puck now. Controlling the offensive zone, everything now is on the line. It takes hard work in the intangibles to get available for a one-timer in that low slot area. You know it's going to be a grind. You're going to have to fight for your space. He does a great job of it and buries it home. Tulsa's got to feel like they've got some extra energy now with that one goal lead here in the third. Well, you can see the finish line, but you're not there yet. So you got to make sure that you continue to press, James. You got to close quickly on your opponent when they have the puck. Don't give them an inch in all three zones. Here's a short pass to Lodge. Trying to pick the corner of the net. On oh, there's so many things that he does well here, James. He fights for the interior of the ice. And he gets a great look and just misses wide. Tulsa's looking to break out. Sends a pass over. Shot! Oh, what a pass save by Morris! Nearing the midway mark of the period, Tulsa's got a one-goal lead. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Kansas City's on the attack. And he slides it quickly for Jones. Stopped by the goaltender. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. Tulsa's been going in one direction all night long, and that's to the net. And they lead it in this third. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. In front, and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Puck possession so critical in today's game, and the official ready to drop the puck right here. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. Denied that one. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Won the draw, they look to set up. Kansas City's got possession here in the offensive zone. Scores! And the kid comes up clutch here in the postseason. Oh, he does it. James gets his first playoff goal. I mean, it's incredible the confidence that this should give him. I mean, the pressure and the stakes are high, and he delivers. Well, he had his eyes on the puck. He tracked it perfectly and got himself set to position. James, I thought he had it. He got a good chunk of it. But he didn't get it all. 
Kansas City's determined effort has resulted in the tying goal in period number three. They've had a lot of pushback and a lot of fight in this game. They've been poised, they've composed, but now they're finding a lot of fire in their step and a lot of jump as well. And they've got the equalizer and they've got to continue on, continue fresh and contribute more. Tulsa's got the puck. Quick feed to Gervais. Mercer to Curry. Fires it into the offensive zone. Slides it quickly to Buck. Gaining momentum up along the side. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Morris hangs on to the puck to stop the play. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. He grabs the puck here at the point. Club save. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Setters get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. Nice job tying up his opponent. Here's a chance. And the puck banks off the puck. What a steal in his own end. We got a stoppage. Let's get the call. Sometimes it's just a product of keeping your feet moving. And when you reach and you take your opponent's feet out, you're going to get the two minutes for tripping. First chance of the night here on the man advantage. Well, they've earned their first power play of the game. A tone setter right here and an opportunity to look at the coverage on the setup. And they get the puck out of harm's way. Fires it! And he gets a piece of that one and denies it! Now a quick pass to Constantini. Fires it on net! Denies him on a slapper! Covers it up and will get a stoppage in play. Hayhurst set the face-off dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. Kansas City's won the defensive zone draw. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Takes a shot, and the puck dies with the trapper save. Side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Tulsa's got the puck after winning the defensive zone faceoff. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Puck cleared from the defensive end. And sends it just out of reach. The Oilers gain control of the puck against the wall. Sends one up to Gervais. Grabs the puck. Battle ensues for that loose puck on the boards. The Oilers have it in the offensive zone. Gives them nothing in front. Oh, they do it again! That's a fantastic save by the goaltender, but his team has to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Those high-danger scoring chances eventually go in. More than half the frame has been played here. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. And now it's grabbed by Jones. Moves it over to Koski. And he can't hang on after that hit. Oh, what a save on the clapper. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Curry's got it, and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. From the right side, they gain the zone. And he's ridden off the puck. The Mavericks will play it from the defensive zone. Gets the puck in deep. Tulsa's got the puck along the wall. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. From along the walls, they're gaining momentum. Excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. Tulsa's got a hold of it along the wall. Tries to feed it over to Constantini. Shot! Oh, that hits the cage! That's using your head! Morris has been 
terrific tonight, James. I mean, he's faced a high volume of shots. Oh, my goodness, that was the only thing that prevented that from going in. When a tie game, you're looking to get shots to net, and that one almost cashed in high, but it hits the crossbar and ricochets out. The Oilers carry it along the wall. Well, this is just a perfect screen. The goaltender can't find the puck because the screen is looking back and finding a way to take away his eyes. Does a great job, and the puck goes in. Tulsa's on their way to victory if they can hold down this lead through the rest of the third. Well, it's all about game management, but they can't just sit back and hold on. Otherwise, their opponent, they will look to attack, and they will take advantage. Put them back on their heels. Be in the offensive zone where they can't get an opportunity to attack you. Kansas City's got a hold of it against the wall. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. Great reach by Hayhurst. Hangs on to the puck after taking a hit. The Mavericks have it against the wall. Takes the pass. The Oilers take it across the line. Sends the pass over. And play continues as that goes off the glove. Moves it quickly over to Hayhurst. There's a shot and gets a piece of it with the trapper. Kansas City's emptied the net. The extra attackers now out on the ice. Quick pass to McKee. Fires towards the empty net. Scores into the empty net. This is right in my wheelhouse, James. These were the type of moments that I played in, and everyone can take a breath now that the insurance marker has hit the 4 by 6 You can see the emotion on everyone on the ice as that empty netter went in. That's an insurance marker, and that's going to be the game. Tulsa's got time, and after that empty netter, Quite a significant lead on their side now here, Cheryl. Yeah, James, it's all but over, isn't it? And that's a great play to be able to get that puck 200 feet down the ice when you're under pressure with the extra attacker. The Mavericks move to the offensive zone. They fight for it along the boards. Morris gets to the bench for the extra man. And that brings an end to this one here this evening. A complete team effort tonight, and as a result, Cheryl, They've gone up in the series. Yeah, it's got to feel good to go up in the series and have a leg up on your opponent. Now it's about continuing to do exactly what got you into this position. Continue with the good habits and continue to press. Great night of playoff hockey, and we'll do it all again when we see you next time.